hello again everybody I am back and if you notice uh, this is the same day I filmed my other video just because I have three things to open so I was just making three videos all in one go so don't be mad at me but this video is going to be what I ordered from Sephora um, it was actually the Monday, I think, before Thanksgiving, I ordered it, and I was supposed to get, like, the free three-day shipping, but it didn't come to me until the Monday after Thanksgiving, and I was back at school then, so I wanted to film this on Friday or Saturday um, during my Thanksgiving break, but because it didn't come until the Monday after Thanksgiving and I was at school, I couldn't film it till like, two, three weeks later, but it's here now, and I'll get right into it. I did pre-cut it just so it would be easier and not as awkward to see me do that. Here's this. La, la, la. First thing is this Clean White Woods Eau de Perfume. It's just the samples on top that I got. It's on, it's clipped on here. I smell it. it smells pretty good. There's that. It doesn't have a thing, it just pops right out. Right, moving on. <laughs> the next thing is the Pink Sugar Eau de Toilet. And the little sample packaging comes in is really cute. Looks like candy, does it not? I wish it was candy. It is seriously like opening candy. Like, what is this? Oh. Ooh. Ooh, it smells really good. It says, The head notes are bergamot, orange, raspberry, and fig. The heart is licorice blossom, lily, barbapapa, I don't know what that is. Red fruits and strawberry. What's the difference between red fruits and strawberries? I thought strawberries were a red fruit. Anyways. And the base is vanilla, which I can smell. Candy, musk, tonka, and sandalwood. This smells awesome. Even It's not even open, and it smells awesome. I guess this is why so many people on YouTube like it, and so many people in general really like it. I'm super pumped for this. I like that better than the clean one. It smells really awesome. Anyway, and the last thing. I don't think I wanted this as my sample, but I got it anyways. It is especially Escada. Delicate notes. Eau de toilet. Does it tell me what it smells like? No. <laughs> to open it. Does it tell me what it smells like? No. I thought it would say on the inside. A lot of perfume samples. Oh, I can't smell it. I don't want to like... I hope it smells bad. Oh, I got it on my hand. Kind of smells like grandma smell. But not a bad grandma smell. I guess more sophisticated. I like that too. Not as much as I like the pink sugar one. I will not even lie. I like sweet scents. Like, I love smelling like vanilla, so that's why I like pink sugar so much. Whoa! Okay, there's that. There's this. Ooh! Another sample thing of Gucci Guilty Black Porfin. Pink pepper and sparkling amber. Inform the daring impulse for dark romance. What's this? Is just for more perfume samples? I think so. That is what that is, and hmm, <laughs> good luxuries. Um, they're just little things that you're open and rubbing all over, so I don't know. What's that? Fancy. Looks, looks fancy. What's that? A lot of perfume. This is my order form. Alright, and because of that, there was a code going on, and you could get this big, lovely, adorable bag of samples, and it's a really cute bag. I chose probably the cutest one because I didn't like like the lips and stuff. I just chose this quirky, cute one, and it's really, really nice. Won't even lie to you about that. This is sample. <laughs> Can you not see bags? So the first thing is this like one use packety thing of the Yves Saint Laurent Toshi Clat. Is that how you say it? I didn't take French. I took Spanish. And so it has 
with number one, two, and four point five. Sometimes it's darker the way it goes. So there's that. Probably not gonna use that because I don't use concealer, highline concealer, that sort of stuff. I don't use that. The next thing is another like one time thing. It's the Stila Double Duty Beauty. What is this? Convertible color dual lip and cheek cream. A lot of like packety things in this, so just so you don't care. Ooh, this is Desire Dolce and Gabbana. I'm guessing it's a perfume sample, and it is. More perfume samples, which I'm fine with. Does this tell me what it's like? Like when they tell me what the scents are, so I don't have to guess. So I don't really know. Eau de Parfum Intense. That's what it says on here. I can't smell like this thing, and I already sprayed one hand, so I'm not going to spray the other. But I like the box, it's shiny gold on the inside. Trust me, there are more perfume samples, don't you worry. Oh, and this is the Clean Skin one, which I'm just going to ruin everything right now. I'm going to just, I'm going to not open that. I'm just going to want to drop it everywhere. This is the last perfume, nope, just kidding, there's two more. This one is, oh, just kidding. This is Bumble and Bumble Hairdresser's Invisible Oil, which I don't know what this is. It's nice, but I don't really use hair stuff either. I'm the worst person for stuff like that. Okay, this is the last, like, perfumey kind of thing. This is Flora by Gucci. Glorious Mandarin. Eau de Toilette. It's fancy. Bam. This is one I have to open too. I hate these because I feel like I want to drop them. I like this. This smells pretty good. It smells something like my mom would wear. Like, not like an old lady thing, but I mean, it just smells like something she would like. But I like it too. But there's that. I think some of the stuff I'm gonna get to my mom. It's okay. This is Dry Bars Cream Soda Soothing Cream. I don't know what that is. Why well, you'll love me. Perfect styling cream for all hair. Oh, it's for hair. It's leave it. Style away. This is Tantalizer Body Bronze and Luminizer from Lorac. Oh, it's for your body. I will not use this because I don't tan, I don't self tan, I don't fake tan, I don't do none of that stuff. I'm comfortable with my skin color the way it is. Next thing is the Ultra Repair Cream from, what is this, First Aid Beauty? Yep. That explains itself. Thing is the L'Occitane, L'Occitane, I don't, I don't speak French, it's the milk concentrate for your body, I'm so, so it's like a lotion-y thing. Anyways, the next thing is the Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer, which I don't use foundation, so I'm not gonna use that. And the last thing out of this adorable bag that kind of feels like a balloon. Or like a thick balloon, anyways, is the Glam Glow Youth Mud Tingle Exfoliate Treatment. Super sexy, super radiant skin, sample sexy. That's what it says on there. So it's just a mask. Everyone talks about it on YouTube. Now I'm one of those people that says that everyone talks about something. But <laughs> there's that. And that is all in this bag of mystery goodness and Crystal's bag, which I really like. I don't know, it's quirky and it's cool. And it kind of is completely my style. Alright. Now to the real stuff. The stuff I paid for. A lot of it was from the, um... Sorry, I'm watching Adventure Time. A lot of this stuff is from, like, the Black Friday sale that they had. And, like, all that good stuff. Oh, I lied. I also got... I'll do that last. So the first thing, sorry, is the Too Faced Ready Set Prime eyeshadow primer duo which has original and candlelight and so it just shows you this is probably my favorite primer but it's expensive and the thing is like one of these is like full size is I think like 17 or 18 dollars I think the pair of these two no okay but um both of these equals the same amount as a full size and weight 
and this was I think ten dollars. So here are these two, and plus they're really easy for traveling, and they're squeezy tubes, so I feel like they're easier to get stuff out of completely. So here's the original, here's the candlelight. I never use the candlelight one, so I'm excited to try that one because I've never tried it. So I think they were ten dollars, or was it? I think it was ten dollars. I got it because. I actually don't need any more primer, but I always have a lot, so I don't have to... Why am I over-explaining them? I'm sorry. The next thing is... Ooh, this is in bubble wrap for protection. It is the Stila... What is it? Artful Eye Collectors Edition in Volume 2. Which is a palette, and it is filled with... Wait. Wait for it. A bunch of really awesome neutrals. So you have a cream shade. It's I think it's like a satin cream shade. You have a brown, a bronzy color. Copper. I don't, don't describe it. Here, I'll just read patchouli, ember, amber, ember, sandalwood, rosewood, and eclipse. I think eclipse is the only matte one. There's a matte black, and then. I got this. This was also too not too. Uh, uh, I'm talking too much. This was ten dollars from the sale that they had during the Black Friday and Thanksgiving, and it's a magnet glass, and it's thin enough. This would be good for traveling. Is that one? All well, these are travel things. The next one is the Stila Artful Eye in Volume Three, which has. The more colors in it. La 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 la. It's this one, which has really awesome shades. Like I really like these two, and then these ones would be fun just to play with. And so they are in the colors: light apricot, umber, aquamarine, soft violet, and ocean. But there's that one, which I'm excited for because it's more colorful and fun. Also, easy for traveling. And this is the Sila what is this? Collage of Color Lip and Cheek Palette. Which is also ten dollars and part of that one deal. And do do do. Bam. It's in Peach Poppy, Coral, and Raspberry. And so I'm probably just gonna use these on my lips because I don't do anything on my face. I just do like eye makeup and lip makeup, so there's that. I am excited. Also in the same kind of thin thing. What the heck is this? Right. So bad I don't remember some of the things that I have. It is the Nails Ink 3D Glitter Special Effects in Made of Veil. Same kind of. It's silver and bluish. Where's my light? I don't know how to describe it, but I do like these because these do give ridiculous glitter payoff. I think this was five bucks because it was on sale. And then I also have one last thing from Stila, and it is the portrait of a perfect eye. So in this one, this was I think sixteen dollars. And. Ooh, there's a quote that says, we do not remember days, we remember moments. And then, I don't know. Okay. It's in parchment, organza, vintage, the point of the right ones. Linen, antique, and rosewood. So I have the plastic was over it. La 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 la. I, that's also neutrally goodness. I haven't used any steel eyeshadow, so this is the first... Let me think about it. Dang, this was 10 and this is 16. I probably didn't need to buy this, but I did anyways. Considering this is... This is 5. Wait, how much? How does this... How much does this weigh? I'm having issues talking. What the heck? This is more expensive, but this is more product. Weird, right? But anyways, I got that too. Uh, um, I finally got rid of of my points. So I got the 500 point perk and it's the Stila set. 
Best of Stila collection. I'm dropping everything. Someone help me. That was weird. This has words on it. Duh. There's an opening thing. Excuse me, I'm an idiot. I open it like that, and I opened it like. Pretty cool, kid. The first thing is the Stila Convertible Color in Peony, which is a mauve color. La, 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 la. Next thing that's a little at me is the Stila Eyeshadow in Kitten, which I've heard a lot about. I've never used it because these are all my first Stila products, so excited. Is that? The next thing is the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in Beso. Beso. So. Next thing is the Stila Lip Glaze in what are you? Apricot. Let's see. It's got some shimmeries in it. And the last thing is the Stila Smudge Stick Waterproof Liner in the Cult Lionfish. I like that name. It's brown? Yep. And it's br brown. Brown. Where's my hand? Sorry. I haven't a rough day. It's been a long day. And that, my friends, oh, excuse me, I gotta. This is, is all the mess that I spent all my money on. I'm probably gonna give some of the stuff to my mom. Like, I'm probably gonna give this color, this the convertible color to my mom. But I think that's about it that I'm gonna give to my mom. <laughs> I'm a horrible person. Maybe I'll give her the lip gloss. She loves lip gloss. If you liked this video, thumbs it up. I apologize. It was so long. Um, also, if you got anything from Sephora recently from like their Black Friday kind of a thing, tell me down below in the comments. That would be cool because sharing is caring. Um, follow me on Instagram and Tumblr if you have either of those. I will link those down below. And that, I'm like, oh, whoa, this video is so long. I'm so sorry. I will just end it here. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!